Let's play a clip of the movie. Sure. Okay, and let's talk about it. Here you we got go. it. She, she ate too much candy, so her stomach was upset. I was just trying to make her feel better. I gave her some of my jewelry and lip gloss. Okay. What I'm saying is that it's a very vulnerable time for her right now. So temporary things like fake eyelashes could affect her permanently. I would never put fake eyelashes on a child. And by the way, it's called mascara. Because that's what all little girls need when they're feeling low, right? Yes, Jason. Sometimes they do. Okay, so let's talk about the scene. <laughs> let's talk about the drama that's going on and the relationship between the two characters, right? So you're the mother-in-law. Yes, the I play Cassandra. Mother-in-law. Tell yes. us about the role. Yes, Cassandra. Um, I, I thank him so much when he mm. came to me with this project. He was like, Vivica, I wrote this for you. Absolutely. I can't do it without you. I was, I was his first and only choice. Yes, so for us to be here now and, and watch it, it's like so surreal, you know? So Cassandra is estranged from her son, um, only to discover that he passes. And not only does he pass, but then I go to make arrangements, and he has a husband, a child, nothing that I knew of. So we go on this amazing journey of discovery, rejection, mm. acceptance, love, and family, mm. in that order. Mm. Yeah. yeah. That. And what was it like working together again? It was incredible. You know, my I started directing in music videos, mm -hmm. but then I got into episodic and I directed multiple episodes of Empire, but my very first episode directing Empire was with Vivica, and I remember this <laughs> special scene between Viv and Taraji and Tasha Smith and the great Alfred Woodard. And it was just amazing to direct her, and, and she, I've known her since I was eight years old. Wow. So she truly is a part of my I family. I didn't realize how far back. Yeah, yeah, this isn't some sort of industry friend or, mm. or co-worker. This family. truly is my family. Mm -hmm. So when I picked up the phone and I said, I can't do this without you, and, you know, as we mentioned before, going through those things, she could have said, no, I'm not sure, but she was fully in. She never swayed, never switched up, and I'm grateful. And we shot this in 11 days. Yes. And, uh, yes, shot in yes, 11 days. 11 days. Yeah. Yeah. A year ago, and we're here with y'all talking about it, so it's pretty special. Yeah, so so for you and your character, you're, you're mm -hmm. the, the husband. I'm the uh -huh. husband. And you have the, the, a daughter in the, show, in, the, in the movie. And so for you to kind of put this story out there, right? Because this is reflective of what some families look like and yep. feel like exactly. the estranged yes. mother-in-laws mm -hmm. and so on and so forth. Maybe not the lost part, mm -hmm. but really just being seen in this kind of context. Sure. Yeah. Talk about that, that journey. Uh, you know, I was really inspired by my mother's story. Uh, my mother in the mid-70s married, as a black woman, married into a non-black family. And, and that time, particularly, there was not, it wasn't necessarily easy to navigate. Yeah. And the things that she went through, um, and then when my father passed, having to deal with some of the grief of there, were more, there was more that I needed to say to him mm -hmm. before he passed and that I wanted to hear from him, it inspired me to make amends with him from the other side mm. because I watched my mother make amends with mm -hmm. his mother, my grandmother, after he passed. Right. And so they are kind of based on my character and Viv's character kind of really based on my mother and my grandmother, mm. who now is able to be a phenomenal grandmother to her grandchildren and her great-grandchildren, which she wasn't able to do before. Yeah. And real, oh, go, go ahead. Go ahead. No, and real quickly, you had the screening last night? Yeah. Yes. How was it received? They laughed, they cried, they went on the journey with us. And, and we've we we've, we've, we've premiered it in in Miami with American Black Film Festival yes. in London in Seattle in Atlanta in Los, Los Angeles, Angeles and, and, and New York and it just has it was been awesome. so well received so yeah. hopefully it'll be wonderful. well received at the theaters as well oh, let me tell you great. some of that stuff that I saw in that scene I know it's a drama scene but like if my mother goes near my daughter with mascara <laughs> or eyelashes you want to let me tell you right now <laughs> It's actually Because really life imitates art. I know that's what oh, grandmas do. They get those babies, and they're like, okay, here's the candy. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's so wonderful yeah. to see you both. Awesome so great to see, to see you back. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.